Vice President Kamala Harris held her biggest campaign rally to date in the battleground state of Georgia yesterday. She's reportedly ready to name a running mate as early as next week. And today, as Leah Michigan reports now, former President Donald Trump is in Pennsylvania as he and running mate J.D. Vance continue to throw barbs at Harris over the southern border. Vice President Kamala Harris took the stage before a packed house of thousands in Atlanta yesterday. The momentum in this race is shifting. And there are signs that Donald Trump is feeling it. Her first campaign stop in battleground Georgia as a 2024 presidential candidate featured star power and renewed enthusiasm among the state's Democratic voters. I am excited that she's kind of reinvigorated the race. It all comes as CBS News has learned that Harris is expected to name her running mate by Monday. Next week, Harris and her VP pick will crisscross the country, starting Tuesday with a rally in Philadelphia. Pennsylvania Governor Josh Shapiro is believed to be among the contenders. I trust she will make that decision on her own terms when she is ready. Out west in Nevada, Republican vice presidential nominee J.D. Vance sharpens his attacks. Kamala Harris's vision is open American borders and closed American factories. A new Trump campaign ad also doubles down on slamming Harris over immigration. She just lied. The border is secure. Harris hit back with her own ad bashing Trump's record. Donald Trump blocked a bill to increase the number of Border Patrol agents. Today, the vice president will speak at a historically black sorority event in Texas. Trump will attend the National Association of Black Journalists Conference in Chicago and then hold a campaign rally in Pennsylvania. Leah Mishkin, CBS News.